Hey guys, Mix and I R on US 007 Animal Style. Uh, today's video, what we're going to do is we are going to give you guys an idea of what the upgraded vehicles uh, damage can take. So all the vehicles behind us have been fully repaired, 100%. Uh, the second one has been upgraded with level one. The one behind that has been upgraded to level two, and the final one there has been upgraded to level three. Combined alloy, non-ferocious, and ferocious, respectively. Uh, so what we're going to do is we've made a consistent environment here with the same weapon, same distance. We're going to get in the back of these vehicles and shoot them up in a minute so you can kind of take a look at how much ammo and how much damage these uh, vehicles can take. So we're going to walk over here quickly now so we can take a look at these vehicles. And taking a look at this one here, you'll see that, again, it has no upgrades, but it is, in fact, fully repaired. Uh, moving on to the next one, you'll see that this one here does have level 1 upgrades installed on the engine, the chassis, chassis, the window, and the body. So all of them, again, fully upgraded. In addition, uh, level 1 on ferocious material upgrade. Uh, this one here, again, we'll see level two, fully uh, fully repaired. In addition, engine, chassis, window, and body, all level two, which is the non-ferocious material upgrade. And then the final one, uh, we'll see again, fully repaired, and level three, fully upgraded, which is the combined alloy, again, on the engine, chassis, window, and body. So, again, fully upgraded, fully repaired. We're going to now get in the back of these vehicles and see how much damage each can take to see if the upgrade is worth all the trouble. All right, guys, uh, we're going to start on this uh, little experiment, again, going left to right. Uh, we are in the back of the DSHKM, and we are going to start opening fire on this vehicle that is fully repaired with no upgrades and see uh, how much damage it can take. And three, two, one, let's take a look. Ten bullets, looking pretty strong here. 20. Uh, looks like we've blown out all the wheels for sure. That might be a wrap. We're going to give it... Yep, we have. So, 20 bullets uh, from the DSHKM, and uh, it is history. We're now going to move on to the level 1, take a look and see what we can do here. We're going to go with uh, another 20 bullets right off the top, because we know that it can take at least that. That's also, uh, that's actually 21 bullets, and it looks like we might have blown it up, so... Ooh. Uh, nope, we're still going to keep going. 2, 3, 24, 25. Looking pretty strong here. 26. That looks like a wrap. So, 6 extra bullets for that upgrade. We're now going to move on to the next vehicle here. You're going to get in the back of the truck. So, 26 bullets. We're going to go ahead and open this bad boy up. Twenty. Five. There's 26 bullets on a level 2. Looks like it's still ready. 27, 28, hmm. 29, wow, three extra bullets, that's it. So, the level three, final upgrade, let's take a look at what we got. We got 21 bullets where we need to reload, so we're going to unload all these. There's 21. And 26, 27, 28, 29, just what we did on the level 2, 30, 31, 32, looking pretty strong, 33. So, as you can see, guys, it only looks like about three to four additional shots. Per upgrade, granted this is from a pretty heavy-duty gun, 
what that relates to from an actual uh, normal gun that would take a shot at you while you're driving. You know, you can kind of put that in perspective. But uh, that kind of concludes today's experiment. Uh, if there's anything else you guys would like us to test, uh, just go ahead and leave it in the comments section below or jump on. Uh, again, US007 animal style. Uh, give us a message and we'll see what we can do. I uh, hope this helps you guys and uh, happy looting. Completely repaired, but able to have upgrades. Okay, you just ran into me and broke my leg, so we're going to cut because you're an idiot.